everyone and welcome back to another tutorial on my Minecraft channel and today I'm going to be telling you all how to install Minecraft shader packs but first of all what I would like to do is I would like to tell you if you like Rocket League go check out my Rocket League channel I have two channels now one for Minecraft and tutorials and one for Rocket League so yeah I actually made a Rocket League video today and you should go check it out if you enjoy Rocket League so yeah back to the tutorial so first of all, what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to install Minecraft Optifine. If you've already installed Optifine, go to the time and point in the video that I have on screen right now and that will be if you have Optifine how to install shader packs. So anyway, what you're going to do is you're going to install Optifine, you're going to click downloads and you're going to, whatever Minecraft shader pack you want on, Optifine is actually very good because what it does is it creates less lag. It makes you less laggy when you play Minecraft. So I already have it on most versions, so I just might as well just download it for Minecraft 1.11. So then it will take you to an AdFly link, which you will just wait for it, obviously, to be done. And then you will click Skip Ad. So once you have skipped the ad, you're going to click Download Optifine. It's going to start downloading and then it will you'll press keep and it will scan if you have McAfee if it's safe or not but this is safe so it will be okay and then you click you click on it and then yeah it will say this random stuff I didn't even know I just clicked install you might want to extract it I didn't even know I just click install it doesn't really matter for me so once you've done that what you can do is you can just open Minecraft. So mine, I'm just opening it right now. I'll tell you when it's open. So yeah, once the Minecraft launcher has opened, you will click launch options, add new, whatever you want. Just title it maybe Optifine. I don't even know what you'd want to call it, but I'm just going to call it Optifine. This is the bit you need to pay attention to. You click latest version. You click on the version pretty much. And then you go down and you click on Optifine 1.11.2 or pretty much whatever Optifine you installed. And then once you've done that anyway, you'll just click save, new, and go to it and click Optifine. And once you're on Optifine, you click on it. You just need to run it once. Okay, once it's open, then you will be able to install the shader pack. So yeah, right now it is opening and since it's opened now, you can just quit off it, go to any Minecraft shader you want, I don't really mind what I want, I just, I'll go with any shader, Sonic Ether's unbelievable shaders, could be good, I don't really know, so I'll just download it, wherever the download link is, is there even a download link? Yes, there is a download link, so I'm just going to go with this, because it just says it's recommended, so might as well. Then it'll take you to an AdFly link, and then once the AdFly link is done, it will, yeah. Okay, whatever that thing was saying, I don't really care, but I skipped it, and I have read and accepted the EULA. Yep, I just, I don't even know, I don't know what EULA is. It's just some thing, okay? Some thing to do with Minecraft. You just tick it, you don't even need to read it. It's just a lie, you don't actually need to read it. Okay, so once it has downloaded, what you are going to do is you're gonna hold down Win and R, and you type down, what you type down is percent, no, that's not even a percent, percent app data, percent slash dot Minecraft slash. So once you type that down, you click OK, It'll bring you to your Minecraft folder. Then what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to create. You're going to have to create a folder, and you call it Shader Packs. And once you've created the Shader Packs folder, you're going to do that. You're going to open it and drag and drop this into it. So once it's been dragged and dropped into it, I'll show you on Minecraft what it looks like. So yeah, once Minecraft is open, you just click single player or anything you want. I'm just going to create a world. I don't really care. What you're going to do is you're going to click options. 
and then you're going to click video settings, performance, fast render off, and then you're going to click shaders and turn on the shader pack. So this is obviously going to be bring your FPS down a ton. It just made my Minecraft just not respond for a second. Your FPS will most likely drop so much. Usually when I use shaders, I always have installed a light shaders Minecraft thing. But this is like an ultra one, so like major lag pretty much. Yeah, this is pretty much what it looks like. So yeah guys, thank you everyone for watching. I hope you all enjoyed the video and goodbye everybody.